Hello, and welcome to the amazing undersea world of Planet Netherlands. And by undersea, I mean literally undersea level. Amsterdam, with its many canals, is known as the Venice of the North, which, if you like to avoid being constantly underwater, is not necessarily a compliment. But Amsterdam is different. It has survived under sea level for centuries. That's why today's Dutch people are so tall. The short ones drowned. Indeed, many structures in Amsterdam start under sea level but dutifully work their way upwards, from canal houses to high rises to trees in the park, leaving this cyclist to apparently bike underwater. Even Dutch primitive art depicts where the sea level sits and the large amount of infrastructure they've built under it. Other primitive art depicts the Tower of Babel, so close to the heavens that God strikes it down. The Dutch are like Babel in reverse, with tunnels so deep they are begging to be filled up with water. And it's no accident. Dutch engineers keep meticulous notes of exactly where sea level is with their famous NAP line or Amsterdam Ordnance Datum. Whereas the international standard for the kilogram is in France, the global standard for sea level is located in Amsterdam City Hall. In fact, there's an entire museum dedicated to the sea level marker. Where do they keep it? Of course, like idiots, under sea level. Mm -hmm. 